this video, we're going to talk about how to pause your render animation in Blender. So as you all probably know, Blender does not have a pause button to pause your animation, at least as of Blender 3.3 LTS. But there is a way we can kind of pause your render animation and that is done by outputting the individual frames in your animation as images instead of rendering out a video. So we are basically trying to create an image sequence out of those images and you can convert those image sequence into a video using Blender's video sequencer or any other video editor of your choice. So over here in Blender I'm going to go to the properties panel over here and go to the output properties and most likely over here this is how the view might be just click on output over here to expand it. And then over here, we have the option to set the location where we want our render animation, the frames in our render animation to appear. And we also have a very important option over here, the file format. Make sure to change this to PNG. So that means the output frames will be as images, specifically a PNG image. And the reason why PNG is better is because PNG typically has better quality compared to JPEG or other image formats while relatively taking up less memory in your disk. You can keep the rest of the options over here at default and then you can just go straight over to the render animation and render it. Wait for it to render out the images. To pause the render animation press on the escape key. So press on escape. Alright, it is very difficult for my laptop to handle both a render as well as an OBS recording. And that was the reason why it was lagging a lot. But anyways, if I were to go to the files over here, so I can have this as images. You can see we have rendered four animations and we paused it. Now I want to continue from this render animation. So at the start value over here, I'm going to give this as Five. And the reason why I'm giving it as 5 is because again we have rendered up to 4 frames but now we need to start the render at the 5th frame and continue all the way to 65 frames. Well I'm not going to do that in this video but again I'm just going to demonstrate how to continue your render animation after pausing. So if I were to now render again, again it's going to lag a lot. So now it's paused once again by pressing the escape key. So if I were to go over here, you can see we have continued from the 4th frame to the 5th, 6th, 7th and the 8th frame. And again I paused it. So you can do this to pause and resume your render animations in Blender. So to now create a video out of the image sequence that we created, click on this plus icon over here, select video editing and over in here, I'm going to click on the add button and then select image sequence and basically select all these images over here and click on add image strip and it will create this little clip over here. You can adjust the frames that is being used for this particular animation by controlling the value over here. So we currently only have 8 frames over here and also make sure that your start is set to 0 and also make sure that you go over here, click on this PNG and select video format the ff mpeg video so that it will create a video format and again click on the render and render animation and it should create this video format over here and yeah that's how you pause a render animation and convert an image sequence into a video in blender thanks for watching and see you later bye